Hi guys, welcome back to Sablam Trails. From this video, we will take you on a journey to explore the Penang Island located in the northwest coast of Malaysia. In our previous vlog, we shared our journey via ETS train and Penang ferry to Penang Island. So if you want to know more about this exciting trip, be sure to check out our previous vlog from Butterworth to Penang Island. As we made our way towards the hotel, the roads were alive with vibrant celebrations of Thai Pusam Festival. Thai Pusam is the biggest festival for Hindus after Diwali. The streets were bustling with devotees made their way towards the temples and breaking coconuts. One of the activities commonly associated with Thai person is the practice of breaking coconuts as an offering to Lord Murugan, who is referred as the presiding deity of the festival. Devotees believe that breaking a coconut is symbolic of breaking one's ego and surrendering to the divine. Before checking to the hotel, we decided to get our lunch and we found this delicious cafe which is very close to our hotel. We are highly recommending this Brooklyn Cafe Bar Rasta Brew. stayed in Wi-Fi Boutique Hotel located in Georgetown. The hotel's location was also a major plus as it was situated in close proximity to some of the city's top attractions. We checked into the hotel and freshened up before heading out to explore the city. We first visited the Penang Culture Walk which was beautifully decorated with light adding to the festive ambience. Stop was the stunning He Bu Tin Kuan Yin Chinese Temple. It's a beautiful two story temple overlooking into the sea. The temple was a treat for the eyes with its intricate architecture and colorful decoration. As we wrap up our visit to the temple, we headed towards the Love Lane. Love Lane is a charming little street located in the heart of Georgetown. 
The street is famous for its historic shop houses, colorful street art, and vibrant nightlife. The street is lined with bars and pubs, many of which feature live music and entertainment. Since it was Chinese New Year holidays, most of the shops and cafes were closed. However, we managed to find some street food stalls and tried a mouth-watering shawarma. second day, our first visit was to Strait Key. Not only does Strait Key offer an impressive marina that can accommodate yachts and other recreational boats, but it's also Penang's first and only seafront retail destination. With its prime location right on the waterfront, Visitors can enjoy a truly immersive shopping experience surrounded by the stunning beauty of the sea. Since we were visiting the Straits Key in the morning to see the sunrise, almost all the shops were closed. Unfortunately, the weather also had different plans and the morning sky remained gloomy and overcast. In our hotel, there was a unique attraction that caught our attention, it's Malaya Bicycle Museum. It was a fascinating collection of bicycles from different eras and styles, showcasing the evolution of this popular mode of transportation. We were amazed to see the unique designs and features of vintage bicycles and it was truly an educational experience. After a fascinating visit to the Malaya Bicycle Museum, we continued our journey to explore the vibrant city of Georgetown in Penang.
Our first stop was the famous Penang Street Arts, where we were amazed by the colourful and unique murals that adorned the streets. As you wander through the streets, you will be mesmerised by the vibrant colours and creative designs that adorn the walls of buildings, alleyways and even street corners. Each mural tells a story and captures the spirit of the city, showcasing its diverse culture, history and heritage. As we stroll around the area, we couldn't resist trying the famous old school dessert Rainbow Ice Balls at the iconic 70s Ice Cafe. Next, we ventured into the heart of Little India in Penang, where we were immersed in the sights, sounds and flavours of this bustling neighbourhood. We enjoyed the vibrant atmosphere and saved the delicious Indian snacks. For lunch, we indulged in the mouth-watering dishes at Nyona Palazzo, a restaurant that specialized in the traditional Peranakan cuisine of the region. The blend of Chinese and Malay flavors was truly unforgettable. Finally, we took a leisurely walk through the historic street of Georgetown, admiring the beautiful colonial architecture and soaking up the city's rich heritage. It was a day filled with exciting discoveries and unforgettable experiences that we will cherish for a long time. That concludes our exciting journey through Pinan. We hope you enjoyed our travel vlog and the amazing experiences we shared with you. Stay tuned for the second part of our Penang adventure where we'll discover more hidden gems and immerse ourselves in the rich culture and history of its beautiful city. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and turn on the notification bell so that you don't miss any of our upcoming travel adventures. Thank you for joining us on this journey and we will see you in the next video. Bye bye!